Hello, hello, Aries. I'm going to do a little bit something different. You guys are first because I'm starting to do uh, alphabetic order, something different. Um, this is basically a love relationship. Um, it could apply to anyone that you feel like you're in a relationship with or you're single or whoever you're inquiring about. I'm going to do it a little bit different than what I have been doing. We're basically just read um, in depth what's going on within the relationship and then I'm going to read you know what's going on with you the situation the challenge that you're having to have and then how you see this person and same thing for them so let's get started I already shuffled the cards and placed them on here uh, this is the second time doing yours because I try to do it and then it oh turned God. off my, the phone so See how that goes. So I'm more understanding what's going on. Uh, as I was saying, um, you know, you you have a, a lot of decisions coming towards you in regards to this race, relationship you're inquiring about. But it looks like there's no forward movement happening in whatever you're trying to accomplish within the relationship. And I feel like what you're going towards, you have a lot of passion, you have a lot of drive, but also too, you're in need of something, you're in lack of something, could possibly feel like you're out in the cold, you don't really know what's going on within the relationship, or you're just a lot of need, a lot of questions to be answered in some way or another. But it looks like, you know, if you stay stuck, if you stay you know not knowing what's going on and you're not moving forward and that's probably what's keeping you you know from moving forward you're kind of questioning you know maybe your confidence if you should move forward and you have the eights of cups so that implies to me that you know there is an opportunity there is fate in the works coming towards you and another person possibly but Maybe it's closed off, you know. This two cups has to do with, you know, soulmate relationships, love relationships, just someone in love. But it has a lot of emotional behind it. So maybe it's something in the past that you've had to deal with this person. And there's really no answers on what's your next step with them. And, you know, you could possibly in some way have had history with this person um, in the past. And it's a very emotional thing. Um, but it looks like, you know, whatever you're trying to move forward, you know, you're still going to feel a need. You're still going to feel in lack somehow. That's what I'm feeling. And now what you're going through in the situation or the situation of the challenge. So it looks like to me, Aries, that you're having to deal with, you know, no communication in some way. But it just feels like in some way that you want to be happy ultimately with this person. You ultimately, you know, want something to be said in some way, a light on this situation because you know when you think of the sun card that means ultimate happiness but also too it could indicate you know especially had the moon card right here you know maybe you want something to be addressed with in the situation of you know whoever you're inquiring but it looks like the challenge that you're having to deal with um is the communication part you know maybe there's some things good within the relationship, like you do have a common interest with this person, but maybe in some way there's just this lack, this need, this need to talk or this need to know the answers that you've been wanting to hear from this person in some way. Now their situation and their challenge is a devil card in reverse and the four of the four of cups so it looks like they're dealing with you know maybe some of the resistance of it but i just feel like they want to free themselves from the situation not necessarily the relationship but they ultimately want freedom they want 
need their chains to be taken off, their bonds to be bonded out. But it looks like, you know, with the Four of Cups, you know, there's been a lot of disappointment. This could be a past tense situation that you're still trying to figure out within yourself. But it looks like whatever this person is, you know, they're dealing with a very disappointing situ situation in their life. And they're feeling like they want just freedom. Freedom to, you know, do as they please. Freedom from the chains that have bond them in some way. But they're disappointed too. <clears throat> is what I'm getting. Now, how you view this person is... <clears throat> excuse me. You know, you may have not know exactly what you think of them. Um, you know, when I look at the wands, I think of communication, but, um, if it's a seven of wands, you know, maybe you've pushed through and pushed through, tried to communicate to this person, and now you can't. So it is possible that you can't get through to this person somehow, no matter how much you've tried and tried and tried, because usually... The seven of wands have to do with perseverance. So if it's in the reverse, you know, you you try to be there in some way, I feel like. And, you know, you got the sun card. So maybe you've tried to be there for someone, try to reconcile things in some way. Um, but there's no go with that, is what I'm getting. And that's how you feel with this person. Like, you've tried and tried and tried, but nothing's going through. And how they view you is... A, magician card so maybe they've tried to manifest in communicating with you they've tried to talk with you about things but no go in that so they probably see you in some light as someone who wants to manifest something someone who wants to create something um But also, too, the Magician card could indicate trickery. Because sometimes this card is referred to as a Gemini card. So you could be dealing with a Gemini, too. But I would be more concerned if it was in the reverse. Because if in the reverse, that has to deal with trickery. But maybe in some way... Um, you know, this person wants to manifest the communication possibly with you. They want to talk to you. They want to create something. Maybe a last, you know, something that will last for a good while. Um, but I just feel like both ends, if you really look at it from your side and their side, it looks like what's really going on is there's no communication. I just feel like, you know, if you're in this lack, if you're in this need of wanting answers from this person, you might need to start the conversation or in some way, you know, just, just really start the conversation I'm feeling. I feel like it's more on your side because if you haven't communicated this person, um, I don't know. They got their own struggle, I feel like, but in some way, I just feel like, you know, if you're feeling like this with them, you know, you may have tried, or maybe you don't know how to communicate with them. It's just a difficult situation, because I, I feel like they want to create something with you. I feel like they want, you know, something happen but I just feel like you know maybe you're closed off maybe that's an indication you're not really putting up with the communication because you know how it's gonna go I don't know. that's what I'm feeling hope that resonates with one of you Aries bye bye